and started. Right, okay. In this lesson we're going to do some more work on angles. And I want to talk about angles in a straight line, angles meeting at a point, angles in a triangle, angles in a quadrilateral. Okay, so the angles in a straight line add up to 180. Angles meeting at a point add up to 360 degrees. Angles in a triangle add up to 180 degrees. And if you want to check that, what you could do is you could draw a triangle. You could cut these angles out and then stick them like that. And you'd say that if the angles would make a straight line. And you know that the angles in a straight line are 180. That's how you can check that. Same with a quadrilateral. Add the 360. If you draw a quadrilateral, cut them out. That's a circle, so you can see that that up to 360. Right, now I'm going to do some problems here. Two on straight lines. We'll do two on each, yeah? So here I'm going to tell you that one angle is 100 degrees. I want to find this other angle here. This one here. I'm going to tell you that we've got one that's 50. And one that's 30. I want to find this other angle here. Okay. And this one here I'm going to tell you that one's 180. So this one's A. I'm going to have one forty, one that's thirty, one that's sixty, and we'll find it if I go B. And then we've got a triangle here. I'll tell you, we've got a right angle, and we've got one that's twenty degrees. We want to find this angle B. This one here. And tell you, I've got one fifty, <laughs> and one that's twenty. I want to find this angle B. Yeah, I've got a quadrilateral. I can tell you, I've got two right angles. I've got one that's 40 degrees, let's say. And I want to find this angle A. This one here, we'll say we've got one right angle. We've got another right angle here, let's see. Let's see, we've got one here that's 120. I want to find this angle. B. Okay, so how exactly are we going to do these problems? Now we know that these add up to 180. Yes? Because it says up here that add up to 180. So if I've got two angles here, one's 100 and I've add up to 180. Then I know that 100 plus this other angle which we don't know. Adds up to 180. So we can do 180 minus 100. And that will give for this other angle here. So this angle A here is 80 degrees. Next one here. And if you have two angles that we know, we can add these up. The 50 and the 30, which is 80. And we can subtract that from 180 to find this angle here, so this angle here B is 100 degrees. Next problem here, these add up to 360. So now I've got 180. So this angle E, 
Nu når der til Gold of Fame 1960. Den masse her. But... Nu når det er sådan, hvor kan det jo Fame 1960. Minus 180. Det er galt, at så for angle. Den er kommet så ud og blevet 180, så er angle A her. Det er 180 degrees. Okay. Right. Right, now we've got three angles here, and I want to add them up. Okay, we've got 40, and 30, and 60. I want to add these up, I want to add these up, I get 130. You can check that on your calculator, and I get this other angle, you can do 360 minus 130. And that comes out 230 degrees. This angle here is 230 degrees. Okay, now this one here, this here has a right angle, so that's 90 degrees. So that out 90 plus 20 is 110. Subtract that from 180 because that's what the add up do in a triangle. So this angle here, A, is 70. So it goes 70 degrees. Right, next one here. I got 50 plus 20. So we can add them, 70. and what we'll do next is we'll subtract that from 180. So I do this calculation here and I get 110. So this angle B here is 110 degrees. Next one's here. These two angles are 90 degrees. And then 2 times 90 is 180. And then we've got a 40 here, so we've got 180 plus 40, which is 220. We're going to subtract that from 360. Oh god. Time's on and out. And then we're going to subtract that from 360. You get 140. So this A here is 140 degrees. That's what it is. Right. Here we've got 290 degrees, we've got 90, 90, 120, so we've got 120 